Today, the lesson is about simple future tense. Here, we're going to talk about the formation of sentences, examples, as well as applications. Simple future tense. This tense is used to describe an action haven't happened yet. Form. The form can be affirmative, negative, or interrogative, that means the question form. Subject. The subject can be I or V, or else the subject can be you, they, he, she, it, or any other singular or plural noun form. S is for subject and V is for verb. Let's see how to form sentences under this tense. If the subject comes as I or V, the affirmative will be subject plus shall or will plus verb. Negative will be subject plus shall or will plus not plus verb. Interrogative will be shall or will plus subject plus verb. We can use either shall or will with the subjects I and we but in modern English will is preferred to all if any other noun comes as a subject the affirmative will be subject plus will plus verb negative will be subject plus will not plus verb interrogative will be will plus Subject plus verb. Let's go for some examples. Affirmative, negative, interrogative. I will write. I will not write. Will I write? We shall write. We shall not write. Shall we write? You will write. You will not write. Will you write? They will write. They will not write. Will they write? He will write. He will not write. Will he write? She will write. She will not write. Will she write? Let's see where to use this simple future tense. First one. Action decided at the moment of speaking. For an example, it's cold. I will drink something hot. Second one, future planned action. The president will address the nation tonight. Third one, Predictions on action out of hand. The rain will stop soon. Fourth one. Prediction based on opinion or experience. You will cry after watching this movie. Fifth one. Conditionals. If you eat healthy, 
you will lose fat. Sixth one, promised action. I will keep this information confidential. It's all about simple future tense. Thanks for watching. Next day, we are going to study about word classes. For more videos on learning English, please press the button below and subscribe us.